Hi, welcome to a calculator tutorial by Equizas. In this video, I'm going to show you how you can convert polar to rectangular or Cartesian uh, coordinates using this Casio FX300MS, FX350MS, FX85MS, 82-82SX, and FX2020+. Uh, so all of those calculators that I mentioned will have the same procedure. Uh, let's say you have a magnitude r of 6 and you have the angle of 36.8 from this reference point you want to find the point x and y to enter this value we need to use this button here pole and rectangle the value that you want you will select it this is polar and i want it in rectangle so i will use rect and i have to press shift so press shift and rec now enter the value 6 and then comma 36.8 close D because this is degree I must be in degree and there must be D if it's not there press mode once and then twice and then select degree if I press one it goes to degree which already was so this is I want rectangle press equal now this is the X so 4.8 and 04 this is the value but for the y i have to press recall rcl and then tan button so actually when i press recall that's f so the value will be stored in the memory f i have another video explaining how to use the memory so it's 3.59 now uh, let's say you have a x and y value you have x at this point and why you want to find the magnitude uh, of this and also of this vector and you want to find the angle so x is 4 y is 3.5 now this time I want polar I'm pressing pull and entering the rectangular value of 4 comma 3.5 close equal sign so it shows 5 uh, 5.3 that's the magnitude and we have to get the angle press recall and then F or tan press recall F and that's 41.18 degrees now let's say you want to uh, do this this point F is minus 3 3 and X is minus 4 and you want to find R and theta because I want R and theta so polar minus uh, for the minus I'm entering this minus minus 3 comma minus 4 and then close press equal so it shows that the magnitude is 5 now for the angle press recall and F by the way if you are using uh, 200 plus you will, that's the value just press left arrow and then plus 90 that will give you minus 36 which means from here we have minus 36 degrees let's say you have theta uh, the angle 40 and then r is 3 uh, for this one this is because from this diagram when you enter it into calculator you have to remember that this is minus 40 because it's from the top so you have to enter it in the right way and because I want rectangle press shift and then REC